Hello to you from a city that's never short of style. I'm talking, of course, about the French capital, Paris. We're at the Pat de Pass. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical analysis is Stuart Robson. And what we have coming up for you is action from the foot squad battles. It's the Dons versus Super Veloci. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. And here's how it looks for Dons. Well, it looks like a 4-2-4, which certainly makes it an attacking lineup. The only problem is the central midfield area. They could become a bit too open and find themselves outnumbered in there. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. Well, it's a brave formation, 4-2-4, because they could get overrun in midfield. But if they can get the ball into the front two, keep switching the play into the wingers, they'll certainly pose a threat today. And the right place to cut out the pass. Locatelli. Maldini. Distributing it well. Super Veloci did well to make sure possession changed hands. Giving the ball to the opposition that time. Locatelli. Chukwese. Daniel Maldini. Well timed tackle. Pushkash. And a throw in forthcoming. And the Dons have the ball once more. So deflection, and it will be a throw in. Danmian. Now Quadrado. Room to roam for the Dons on the wing. Locatelli. And a useful cross. But keeper's ball. They'll be disappointed with that delivery. Quite happy to sit deep, but that can have its risks. Really good challenge. And easily intercepted. Locatelli. Chukwese. Can he make it count? And there it is! The opening goal, 1-0, and they'll feel they deserve it. Well, here it is again, and really you have to question the goalkeeper. She shouldn't be beaten inside that near post, even if it was a good strike. So the ball rolling again with the score line standing at 1 0. Olga Carmona. This attack looks highly promising. Federico Di Marco. Giroud. Matteo Damian. The Dons could do damage from here. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Johan Cruyff. 
strong but fair tackle. And nicely over the top. The Dons being afforded too much room. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. And that is that for the first half here on the... Well, the ball is moving again. Super Veloci trailing after the first 45. Can they mount a response here in the second? Locatelli. Electing to cross into the centre. Giroud. Well, capable of a better clearance than that. Chukwese. Just needs to get rid of it. Giroud. Spot on with that tackle. Zinedine Zidane. Super Veloci regaining possession. Textbook closing down, and now they're on the attack. A glorious chance, and still an opportunity. And putting paid to the danger. Well, I don't think they've been at it today, but maybe, just maybe, that great save will inspire them now. Well, they can't exhale just yet. Here they come again. That's a very fine piece of tackling. Cuts it back. Vigorous defending. And he scored not once, but twice. They simply cannot stop him. And no wonder he's enjoying himself. Again. He tries to run out with the ball, he has the ball taken off of him, he's made the wrong decision, and suddenly the ball's in the back of the net. Terrible defending. So back underway with the scoreline standing at 2 0. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Well, foul play, says the referee. And time for the change now. Plenty of support here. But the danger averted for now. Maldini. Giroud. And the ball is loose. It was an attack of promise, but they couldn't take advantage of the situation. Bon Matti. Fifteen minutes left for play. Attacking with vigor. Giroud. Well, nothing for them to worry about in the end. Good defending. Good high press. The fans are shouting, shoot! Well, as he hit that one, it looked as though it had a chance. And with play stop, they will make the change now. Bonmati. 
Cruyff. And defensive play to be applauded. Five minutes left. Well, that's eye-catching wide play. The delivery towards the back post. Well, pretty straightforward for the keeper, you've got to say. And he has options available. But really sticking to the task defensively. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. Well, fine play, and maybe it'll set something up. Able to close down the shot. And there it is, the final whistle. The home fans are going to be happy with this result. Well, Derek, it was a comfortable win in the end. Fully deserved their victory because they dominated every aspect of the game. It was a really good result for them here today.